So today we're gonna to talk about how our development group that we've formed within our company sold out the subdivision of Harbor Beach Club in Indian Harbor Beach. Yeah, it's a, it's a project that consisted of 36 townhomes, all, you know, approximately 2,100 to I think the largest was like 2,400 square feet. The interesting part of it is, you know, how we formed our development group. I mean, you and I have been on both sides of the real estate transaction, or I should say all sides, from being investors, uh, you've developed condos yourself, subdivisions. subdivisions. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This project, for example, we had competing projects around, and the most similar project, I mean, we ended up selling it 32% faster than, than they did. Than they mm -hmm. did. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's kind of typical because you'll see a lot of builders, maybe they have their own in house marketing team. And typically, because of our development group and experience and just horsepower that we have, our sales force on well, our marketing group yeah our, our, our marketing we've got group. our we've got our own marketing group so you got the development group you got the marketing group you got the real estate group you know all in one I mean, well, there's all 17 of us right now in the group so with this specific developer um, they're a publicly traded company they've been around since 1906 there's a board of directors there's a lot of people that have to approve who's going to sell their project it was a big win for us for this developer to retain us for our services so that we could perform and you know, sell this development out. Yeah, and, and and they they relied on us. Remember when we did the pricing, you know, what the insides should look like, the different things. So it was really exciting for us because we, we got a lot of input in there. During those initial phases, whenever the developers retained us, you know, we're looking at floor plans, we're looking at finishes. They want to know like what finishes, you know, are buyers looking, looking for. for. And then because we sell so many homes, we know what's relevant in the marketplace then the, goes to our marketing department and they're creating logos. They're creating the virtual video renderings of the project that's not even there, Correct. which is so cool. So in closing our development group, it's based on the same model, foundation and principles as our residential resale. Mm -hmm. So no matter if you're a developer or you're a regular residential seller, you're gonna have that same experience. Yeah. I mean, luxury is an experience, not a price point. 